Six reasons healthy people don't think they need regular blood tests. Number one, I don't go to the doctor unless I'm sick. Do you let your teeth rot before you call the dentist or do you get them cleaned and examined twice a year? Wouldn't you rather stop a, a preventable problem before it turns into pain, discomfort, or potentially even fatal? Routine testing can detect risk for heart attack, stroke, diabetes, or cancer. Number two, I exercise, eat well, and take vitamins and supplements. Some of us strive to optimize health rather than meet the bare minimum. One way to see what's working and what needs tweaking is to check your labs regularly. Those of us worried well take ownership of our health. What gets measured gets managed. Number three, I have regular physicals and all my health issues are being treated with medications. I'm good. When you might be good or not, many or even most medications have side effects. Some are not serious, others are. Statins, for example, Lipitor, Zocor, and other cholesterol-lowering uh, medications, opioids like uh, Vicodin, Oxycodone, Codeine, and some blood pressure medications have all been linked to low testosterone in men and women. Testosterone is important, more than the reasons you just, you know, that you're thinking of. Metformin, uh, Tagamet, and Zantac have all been connected to thyroid issues. Tylenol, statins, uh, niacin, amiodarone, and things like aspirin and Motrin they can be, they can cause liver problems. And if your doctor isn't checking your testosterone, your liver function, or your thyroid, and you're on these medications, well, maybe you should. It's, uh, it's your health and it's your life. And here's a note too, if, um, if you have type two diabetes, and one in 10 Americans does, you may carry some extra excess body fat. Low T and high body fat go hand in hand. May as well check your T. Uh, or if you're a woman and you have some unexplained weight gain, it could be the thyroid. Okay, number four, not much I can do about it. I have bad genes. Well, not all bad genes are a death sentence. For example, the MTHFR gene mutation, I know it's a funny name, uh, that can explain things like miscarriages, high blood sugar, addictions, depression, cardiovascular disease, fibromyalgia, and many other conditions and it's believed to affect up to 50% of the population. Uh, it's a very simple test to get it, and it's treatable. Uh, there's a guy named Dr. Ben Lynch. You can look up mthfr.net, and he is the expert. Uh, but we have a uh, local expert, too, that we can refer you to if you have the gene mutation. Number five, I take vitamin D and get plenty of sunshine. Well, regardless of how you feel, if you live in a northern climate, you probably have low vitamin D. In fact, if you live in a warmer climate and you always wear sunscreen, you may have low uh, vitamin D too. If you supplement, it's possible that you could have too much. Too much vitamin D is, vitamin D is toxic. So regardless, you should test it and check it and make sure you're within a healthy range. Number six, my doctor says I'm healthy, though I still feel a bit off, but She's the expert, I'm just getting older. Well, nonsense. <laughs> you could be tofi. A uh, tofi is uh, thin outside, fat inside. Go ahead, look it up. Uh, you could have something else, like a parasite or digestive issue or food sensitivity. By the way, a tofi, uh, it basically means you accumulate fat around your organs and that can affect not, you know, the way you look, not so much, but the way your organs function, it can affect your overall health. So anyway, there are lots of other tests and healthcare profession that um, there are lots of other tests and healthcare professionals that can help you find those little problems that your traditional doctor can't. And we have a lot of those tests, and in our network, we have people who can solve those problems. Anyway, um, healthy people keep an eye on their health. They 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 exercise. They eat right, and um, they get regular blood tests.